Morning guys, my name's Joe. I'm the beefy prepper. I'm out here alone today in the woods, in the winter, in the cold, in the rain. I'm gonna see if I can find some gold. So let's go be some gold diggers. My original thought for today was to bring my gas pump down and do some high banking or some dredging, but it's raining, the roads are getting slick, and I couldn't get anybody to drive hours in the bad weather whatever so i'm gonna do some testing um i know the last two videos were testing hopefully it's not too boring hopefully we get oodles of gold This material here, the water has thawed out. It's moving pretty fast. I'm thinking if I go along this edge right here, with the Abbey pump, might find some. I'll also shovel some material there out of the bottom. See if I can find any deposits. Okay, so my first pan, I got a couple nice chunks there. Gonna be a good day. All right, I've done a few pans here, a few pans down there. I had a couple that were pretty nice, but I decided I'm gonna pack up and uh, go downstream, maybe hit a couple of those waterfalls I was getting really good nuggets out of. Not nuggets, for Iowa they're nuggets, more like almost pickers. So winter prospecting has some dangers to it. There's the obvious ones, uh, hypothermia, frostbite, falling through the ice. Uh, you know, you're out here by yourself and something happens and nobody might be able to find you. So I get to walk through this ice. Hope it's not deep. I don't think it is. Um, and it's, it's a little tricky because the ground's frozen you can't can't dig into the bank um you, you can't really see how the water's flowing there are times where there's a little bit of open water like right up here and those are the places you're kind of confined to trying to dig one right over there and there's a couple down there it's not it's not as wide open as summer and spring you just, you, you do what you can. As you see, snow's a little deep. One thing you wanna be careful of out here hiking in the snow, if you start sweating, you wanna shed some layers. Been hiking through the snow, it's a foot or 18 inches in places and uh, starting to get my body temperature up, so I slip my coat and hat off. Try to cool my body back down. You start sweating, that's how you get hypothermia. Uh, I think I found the next place I want to test. We got some pockets here. This gravel's actually thawed out. Um, nice little waterfall here. I'm going to break out some of this ice. 
do a little testing, see if we can find some big gold. Well, I'm taking a quick break. Right there, bottom of that elevation drop. You can see it's much higher there than it is here. There's a little crevice in there between two rocks. Sucked up a big pan there. I was getting excited thinking it was a really good spot. And I was gonna get some good gold and not one speck. Couldn't believe it. I have pulled a few decent flakes out of here um, today. I'm gonna dig around in there a little more. I got the ice broken back a little bit. It's kind of ice damming up down there. And I'm gonna finish this little break and then uh, back in that there water.
So, I actually have enough current here to set up my Robinson sluice. So, I'm just yabby pumping right there in front of it. I may come down here and do a couple buckets and bring them up here. Uh, I have a little one gallon bucket with me and a five gallon bucket if I need it in the base of my pack. I decided to move because the gold wasn't consistent there. I think if I can move a whole lot of material into this Robinson, it'll catch it. All right, let's get to it. I haven't moved a whole lot of material, but I did a clean out. And uh, yeah, the dang co camera would focus. That's uh, not bad gold there at all. No, I'm gonna stick it back in there and pump some more into it. Well guys, getting kind of tired. Takes a lot more energy working out here in the winter. And uh, apparently I've created an ice jam and my water level's coming up pretty bad. I think I'm gonna pack this stuff up and hike out of here. I um, said I'm tired. Wish I could get more gold. I think I got a pretty decent amount though. I think I'll go home, clean up the gold, and show you right here. All right guys, I got about a mile hike out of here. Uh, thanks for stopping by and watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share the video with your friends if you enjoyed it. Look at all these tracks where the deer are coming to get their drinks and stuff.